All right, this is the video for uh, creating a harmonic variation and if you want to sing it or play it. Now I'm using a piano here to demonstrate, but uh, you can use any instrument that you know how to play it, but you should be familiar enough with the notes to be able to add different notes to it and use some of the same notes to create a harmony. And I'll show you how to, to uh, record that later. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to do a recording of just Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, just the way it is. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, how I So that's going to be your first recording. Now what we're going to do is create a harmony, okay? So you're going to have, you're going to, uh, have two things going on at the same time. A harmony is two different things going on at the same time. So we have our regular melody and then uh, above or below it we're going to have something else uh, using the same notes that creates a harmony. So for if you're playing the piano you can do this at the same time. For example, So I had the regular melody going on, twinkle, twinkle, little star. And then I had something else, twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Okay, and I know a lot about music theory, so I know which notes are going to sound good together, but you're just going to have to experiment. So these might sound good together. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle. Those don't quite sound together. So you're gonna have to experiment with different notes that makes a nice melody. Okay. So experiment with different things you can do. One thing is you can kind of think about playing in opposite directions. So when I'm going twinkle, twinkle, I can think of going doing that backwards. Twinkle, 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 twinkle. Another way to do it is to do it in parallel. So instead of going twinkle, twinkle, I'm just going to jump up two notes. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. And that'll be a harmony part. So it'll, it might sound like this. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Okay. And if at some point you need to match the pitch like at the beginning of the phrase or at the end of the phrase that's okay too. So you're going to experiment with different things you can do. Try, try a couple different things and see what you like. Now here's how to record it. In order to record your um, harmonic variation first thing you need to do is create a video of yourself just singing or playing the theme which I've already done here. One, two, three, four, twinkle. And you, it's good to give yourself a count off so that when you record on it again, when you record another track, you'll be able to be ready. Twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above. Okay, so I recorded myself playing it and singing it, but you only need to do one, either playing or singing. And so after you're done with that, I saved it as harmonic variation theme and I save it on my desktop. The next thing you're going to do is go into iMovie and you're going to add a new project. 
import media. And you select that same video, harmonic variation theme, or whatever you called it. And you're simply going to drag it in here like that. Okay. Then you can see your video there. One, two, three, four. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Okay. Then you're going to use this little microphone function to record a voiceover. <laughs> Okay, so you're going to select this voiceover thing. You're going to make, make sure that um, the right audio, this yours should be built in um, microphone so that it picks up the sound from your singing or your instrument. Now unselect mute so that you can hear it as you're singing it. One, two, three, four. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Then you press stop over here and then you're going to trim the audio. I'm going to select this part and I'm just going to go until you see the arrow, the line with the two arrows and I'm just going to trim it back to there. Okay, now go back and listen to it. See how it sounds. Okay, so I had some good harmonies in there. I had some harmonies that I didn't really like. So I'm going to redo it, or I'm just going to let's see if I can just move this over here for now. And then maybe if I like that one later, I can use it. But I'm going to start back at the beginning. Another thing you can do is adjust the volume on here by selecting it and going up to here and just moving the volume up because I want to move it up a little bit. One, two, three, four. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high Like a diamond in the sky Twinkle, twinkle, little star How I wonder what you are Just try a couple di different times recording and playing uh, if you're playing it, only use the same notes. So if you're playing it and it uses these notes, and it may change on different instruments, you should only try and harmonize it with this, these notes. Don't try and do any of the diff different notes. Because it'll sound really funny. Okay, so just use the six notes that are in the song. Okay. So after you're happy with that, I'm going to delete that one. I'm happy with it. I'm going to trim this. Oops. Trim this to here. Then I'm going to do export or share as a file. Then I'm going to say harmonic variation. You don't have to put a description. Okay. You can choose any of these. It doesn't really matter. For these purposes, you can use any of these. The higher the quality, the longer it will take to upload. So uh, it's best to just do 720 and uh, medium and faster because it can take quite a while to do that. The video shouldn't be that long, so it shouldn't take forever. Okay, then you press next and you want to say, okay, harmonic variation, save to my desktop. Then you'll see up here the progress, which is zero right now. Okay, so once that's done, your file should be saved wherever you had it. If it'll show you this little thing, you say, yes, I want to sh show me where it is so I can make sure or show me the file. Okay, so you can see the files right in there. And then you're just going to add that video to the assignment and then you'll be all done. Good luck and have fun creating a harmony.